guys, Kyle, the Death Knight of Anime here, bringing you my review for One Piece Chapter 892. Uh, yeah, surprising, yeah, I'm actually, I'm a little surprised this one came out, because apparently it wasn't supposed to, it wasn't supposed to come out this week, One Piece was supposed to be on a break, so, not sure what happened there, if Oda just decided to come in and say, hey, I'm gonna do One Piece or something, but, yeah, it's we weird, I thought, yeah, I really thought it, that we weren't going to get a One Piece chapter this week. At least that's what I what I saw, but hey, I didn't complain. So, um, one thing I really got liked about this chapter, honestly, is that it felt like a game of chess with the things that everyone was doing. Especially with the way Petta Spetta was taking command of the Big Mom's fleet after she got she got distracted by the whole romance smell of the wedding cake. Also, I gotta say, maybe it's just me, but I really like how natural the pacing in this chapter felt. I mean, it's no surprise to anyone that the pacing of the One Piece manga is better than the anime, but the past couple chapters, excluding the fight with the Straw Hats versus Big Mom, felt it, it was feeling like 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 the like those like those particular chapters, like the story was dragging its feet almost a bit, and uh, so you its feet a little bit, but here. There was never a point where, like in the past, in like I said again, in those in those times, I could actually. There were times where I was thinking, "Why are we focusing on this?" But here, it actually does. I, I never once, I never once asked that question, because yeah, yeah. So yeah, the pacing in this chapter felt really good. I'm I'm surprised at, at how good it was. Actually, it was it was, it was very it felt very natural and it felt very well paced compared compared to the other ones, I guess. Um. So, but the big thing to happen in this chapter was the Luffy versus Katakuri fight at the end, and <clears throat> and on top of the fact that it's turning into a very visceral fight, just with the way Luffy's getting beaten down, we are also seeing more and more of Luffy getting closer to obtaining the power of Future Sight. Like it, it's basically right we, in this chapter. I think we could we could assume it's right in the palm of his hand now, more or less. Uh, but the question is, how much closer is he gaining full control of it? Because, how much closer is he to gaining full control of it? Because, even though we see Luffy got impaled in the final in the final page, Katakuri's mochi thrust was obviously aiming aiming to impale was obviously aiming in order to impale Luffy to the chest. But in the last moment, it looks like we see Luffy jumped out of the way and only got impaled in the side in the in the side of so it was in his stomach or whatnot, which. Uh, in his, some, in his side, so he more than like so. I want to assume basically from, 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 from that is that he basically has the idea and the concept and the core I idea of what he needs to do down on how to map and on how to on how to use that power. He just doesn't have the mastery of it, and it makes me really wonder how many times is gonna how many times Oda is gonna impale Luffy before we see the final. Results of before we see the final of the final results of this new hockey technique that, that Luffy of this new hockey of this new, new, new this new future side hockey technique that Luffy is is basically aiming to control. But uh, yeah, like Oda, how many times are you gonna pill him before? How many more times are you gonna pill him? The dude is suffering enough. Please just show it to us already, for God's sakes. But uh, yeah, like I'm sure it's all part of Oda's plan. I'm sure he has a plan, but it's like yeah, please. I think we need to see Luffy kick some ass now. Like, please, <laughs> he's getting his ass kicked a little too much. <laughs> um, also, one thing I never really thought I'd ever need to critique, but it did come up here, and maybe a little bit in my Hero Academia. I just didn't bring it up. Uh, but it's something I never really thought I'd need to critique. But again, it did come up here. Is the placement of the inner monologue text? What I'm talking about is. Specifically, specifically, is with the placement of Katakuri and Paro Sparrow's inner inner monologue thoughts, and how they're like when when you basically look when you look at the panels I'm referring to, you basically see that that that, 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 that basically the, the inner monologue text is being overlapped by is being overlapped by 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 by, 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 by the weirds of things like, like is being overlapped and 
and and blend and blend it in with, with the weirdest of things like it, it, the text in Pure Oscuro's case, the text, his inner monologue thoughts were, were, ended up blending in with 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 from which the color with with from which all, 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 with, with from which, I think it was the black stripes on his hat, and uh, and with and with Katakuri. His inner monologue text overlapped overlapped with his black hair, with the with the black with the black with the black ink on his inking of his hair. So it's like, yeah, I'm I'm not sure what happened with with the inner monologue text this week, but you'd think common practice would be if you can't read floating text, then you'd put it in a thought bubble or something. Yeah, again, weird thing to note, but. A little, a little tidbit. I'd still, I, I wanted to still make known for, for basically anyone who hasn't read the chapter yet. Like when you do read it, you are gonna see that the there are moments where the inner monologue text just kind of blends in with, with pretty much the characters themselves. So, yeah, that was the only point I needed to make there. Now, we see. You now the big thing to note here is that we see Straw Hats reuniting with Sanji finally, as well as them continuing on to Cacao Island. And after we see what. Oven, oven was planning. I literally shouted, "Is a trap!" Yeah, I know. Weird. Like, uh, I'm, I'm quoting a fucking, I'm quoting a freaking, uh, I'm quoting freaking Star Wars on that. But yeah, just the whole, just the whole setup of this chapter with, with, with basically oven, oven, oven saying, oven saying for, for pretty much everyone to, everyone, everyone to break their mirrors and 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 have and have the one he showed them as the only mirror, mirror available. As mirror available in order to trap Luffy is just like, yeah, like it's one of those things right now where it's looking like where pretty much the, the way this whole this whole situation is set up, it comes down to a couple of different choices. Either one, either the Straw Hats are going to fall into this trap first, since since they're already headed to Cacao Island, or Luffy's going to beat Katakuri in time. Is going to beat Katakuri, but is going to be kind of curry in time in order to, but 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 pretty much have but pretty much end up end up falling into in in in, in is going to be kind of curry but end up falling into that trap. B, uh, they pretty much all end up getting caught in the trap at the same time. Or, or or the other or the other possibility is that 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 neither of those is going to happen, and and what's going to probably end up happening is is is, is probably as. I know it's gonna sound convenient, but if I had to take a wild guess, as as, as if in the situation where where in the situation where, where it ends up being where it ends where it ends up with Luffy being, and where it ends up with, with Luffy being the one who uh, ends with where it ends up with Luffy, I think how it would probably work is that at the at the moment that that all the citizens are breaking their mirrors, I I imagine that there would be that be that one mirror left. Uh, uh, Left that that Luffy would be able to escape from. So, I mean, I I I want to. I know it sounds convenient, but I I think that probably w would be the case in which, in which uh in 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 which, which the trap ended up actually, in which the trap ended up affecting Luffy or whatnot, or, or the other thing is that that they both end up like I said, they both end up falling into the trap, and they just they both end up falling into the trap at the same time, and. Uh, and they end up just causing a whole mess of trouble for, for a whole mess of trouble for Oven. Like, let's face facts. If there's one thing the Strats are known for is, is basically is causing trouble for, for pretty much anyone who anyone who crosses them. And it would be, uh, I think it would be actually can, 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 considering that the Sunny is headed to Cacao Island. I wouldn't be I wouldn't be surprised if the Strats aren't going to be against uh, using. Aren't gonna be again against against using using against using, using, using the I think I think it's the Gowan cannon in order to in order to um in order to uh in order to in order to in order to take care of Evan and his cronies or something but yeah weird but uh, yeah like the like like this whole like this whole situation with with Evan's trap there's like to me there are so many ways it could go down that it's it's not even funny honestly. Um, and, but, yeah, I think, I think the more probable one, honestly, the, just, just the way it was set up is that Oda is probably setting up for it, where, where, where both the Strauss and Luffy are gonna end up, are gonna end up, end up both, are gonna end up, end up falling into the trap, and, uh, and, and end up, 
causing a whole mess of trouble for, for basically Oven. Like, I don't think, I think Oven is seriously under underestimating Luffy if he thinks that this trap is going to work. Like, if he honestly thinks he's going to, like, Luffy, yeah, after Luffy, F, like, especially after Luffy King's future set, I think he is going to, he's going to find, he's going to find some way to use that to his, he's going to find some way to use that to his advantage, probably, in escaping from Oven, if that does happen. Um, so, the other thing to note about this chapter is we get introduced to Sir, to, to, to basically two, to, to basically two, to pretty much, to pretty much two more of Charlotte, of, 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 of Big Mom's daughters. Sin Amon and and sit 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 I've said it before, and I say it again. Like this whole setup of of smoothies falling the straw hats. I really, I really desperately hope this is a setup to finally see what Smoothie and her sisters can do against 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 the straw hats. Like I really, I really want to just see what 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 it is what it is that Smoothie as a character can do because she's just kind of been in the background, not really doing much. So this is here's hoping that that little setup can. Is actually gonna give. Is actually gonna give. Is actually gonna end up giving Smoothie her her moment to shine. Finally, here's hoping for that. Um, and here's hoping Smoothie will finally will finally get to see what Smoothie can do. Um, just please don't wait. Keep us waiting too much longer, Rhoda. I'm especially me. I'm desperate for that. Um, also, on a side note, I normally don't use language like this, but I do gotta ask it now. Are all women from the long, tr long leg tribe thick as hell? Cause Smoothie and her sisters have some pretty damn sexy legs. I, I just have to say that. Like Smoothie, like just the way, just the way that they're they're drawn, that their legs are just. They're, they're, I'll say that, that their legs are very sexy. I'll, and I'm not, and honestly, personal preference. Just getting it out there. I'm not even a leg man. I'm I'm an ass man. Just getting it out there. But yeah, these just seeing these just seeing these ladies is turning me into a leg man, so it's like, yeah, they, Smoothie and her sisters, yeah, yeah, they have some pretty sexy legs, uh, but, um, but, yeah, guys, that's, a uh, that's pretty much all I have for this video, if you enjoyed it, like, comment, subscribe, or follow me on Twitter and Facebook, Death Knight of Anime, signing off, later, guys.